Hi, this is Mike McGelkin, Raiders View Report at the Las Vegas Review Journal. A very busy week for the Raiders. It started on Monday with a return to practice where the team was very shorthanded at safety. The Raiders carry eight safeties on their 90-man roster. Only four of them were able to practice Monday. So you had Obi Melifanu, last year's second-round draft pick, suddenly working with the first-team defense. How he looked was probably subject for film review that we don't have the liberty of looking at, but notably there was one play on 7-7 seven seven when he seemed to drift a little too far shallow. Easy, deep touchdown pass to Keon Hatcher. Melifanu, uh, that miscommunication there in the back end with, while working with Reggie Nelson, he's very much a rookie, still coming along, so good for him to get those reps, learn through that experience, and the Raiders hope he can push for a role and make this football team. Things pick up, however, Tuesday. That's when the Raiders begin two days of joint practices with the Detroit Lions. You're going to have the Raiders offense versus the Lions defense and vice versa. Just more competition, breaking up training camp where the Raiders don't have to go up against each other for once. So that bit of a break for the team helps break up camp. The key thing that John Gruden is looking for is just having it be a productive set of practices. Nobody's looking for fights. Thus far, the Raiders haven't had any of those typical training camp squabbles that you often see between teammates. Will they maintain that peace streak? We'll find out on Tuesday. All this leads up to Friday's exhibition game at Oakland, at the Oakland Alameda Cali Coliseum. We'll have coverage throughout this week from Napa. This is Michael Galkin. More updates online at ReviewJournal.com and in print at Las Vegas Review Journal.